Hey everyone, it's Jason Pannone, Head of Reference and Cultural Assets Manager here at the East Hartford Public Library. I'm back with another episode of Raiders of the Lost Archive after a bit of a break. Um, so I just wanted today to kind of ease back into it with some kind of whimsical stuff, some tchotchkes that uh, have been sold or worn here at the East Hartford Public Library. I think they're kind of neat. And it just shows that um, how much the library is a part of the community here at East Hartford and that people choose to um, honor the library by buying these little things and using them and reminding themselves of the library. So uh, you'll see we've got uh, East Hartford Public Library, the t-shirt from 2013. That was my first year here. And it's for our summer reading program. And usually every year uh, for the summer reading program, we get t-shirts or things that we wear to let patrons know about summer reading programs that we have here for both kids, adults, and teens. Uh, the second thing is a note card of the uh, Huguenot House, which is at Martin Park. And if you've never been to the Huguenot House, I highly recommend going. It's open during the summers. You can drive by any time of the year and take a look from the outside. But if you really want the tour, wait until the summer and hopefully you know, next year you'll be able to get in there. We won't have to worry about COVID and such like that. We've also got, obviously, the coffee mug, East, East Hartford Public Library, the coffee mug, because everybody's got to have a coffee mug to sell, to, you know, to drink your favorite libation, morning libation out of, whether that's coffee, tea, or something else. And then finally, East Hartford Public Library, the drinking glass. This is kind of uh, an interesting find. It was donated earlier this summer in 2020, and um, I haven't been able to find out much about it. When it was sold or offered, the image on the glass is actually of the original library pre-1968 before the uh, major addition was put on to the side closest to the post office. Um, so I don't know when this glass is from. Um, it reminds me a lot of the souvenir glasses that I remember as a kid from the 1970s. But obviously it could be earlier, it could be later. So if you have any information and if you recognize it, geez, we'd love to know about it. Um, so there you go. Just kind of a neat little tchotchke thing to kind of ease us back into the videos. And coming up soon, we'll hopefully have more. We've been really going through the archives down here and have got them really sorted out into um, some categories and have been finding some neat stuff. So uh, I'll have more for you soon. So. Thanks for watching, as always. And until next time, practice safe social distancing, wear your mask, wash your hands often, and be well. We'll see you later. Bye.